worked in a restaurant together and he barely told me this now. I'm like, bro, I could have served you a fucking wrap with Wait, tomatoes in it and then just, that. and then him just died. And I would have been like the murderer of the Christian. I could have died. <laughs> oh <my> <laughs> <God>. <laughs> Another one I did, really fun weekend piece, melting smiley face. I mean, who doesn't love it? It's hot out here. I feel like I'm melting half the time in the shop being in those front windows. But we love seeing you guys. Go ahead and bring in your friends, get matching tattoos, have a great summer and just have those memories. As always, I have plenty of designs up for grabs. I'll have to be honest, I'm not the best at posting them, but if you go ahead and message me on Instagram, I can send you sheets and sheets and pages. I have at least 70 available designs right now. So if you walk into the shop or anything, we always got something for you. Um, one of the big ones that I'm looking forward to doing is a neo-traditional bear holding like a lantern, but instead of like a traditional lantern with like a candle light or anything like that, it's gonna have glowing crystals inside, bright colors, as well as some natural colors as well. So it'll be really poppy and a lot of detail. It'll be great. So Sydney is a great client too. Everybody is. And she got her first tattoo for her birthday. It was like simple lettering on her forearm. And then a couple months after she came back and said, hey, I want this little like vein with leaves and like a butterflies. And I was like, great. Once she came over to the shop, we stencil up everything and it ended up being a whole half sleeve, which is amazing. She wanted to have some little letters on each wing of the butterflies and just black and gray line work, fine lines, little details. She loved it, absolutely loved it. It was great, I love that one. So I have two designs for grabs. There is one with skulls and a crown of flowers, beautiful one. We can do color on it or just black and gray and fine line. That's what I love too. And the other one is like um, leaves that you can put like this. Pretty much just leaves, line work, colors, and the leaves are gonna have some textures. It's gonna be super pretty. If you bring that maybe here, or maybe here, or maybe here, anywhere, maybe here, anywhere. Come and grab them. How's your Friday going? Uh, solid, as expected. Overwhelmed, a whole bunch of shit going on, and never enough time. I also worked on a returning client on a Virgin Mary on her back. It's a relatively large piece. We did some filigree work around the edges and mainly what we were working on completing is the central portion of the, of the back design today uh, or that particular day. It's challenging sometimes working on those custom designs for people on a larger scale. Just you never really know how people are gonna be able to handle it. And sometimes time factors play into it. And so this particular client was traveling to us to come meet us. And so we've had to break apart our sessions a little bit and be very methodical about how we're putting things together. Hopefully we'll be able to get back together soon and be able to finish this up. But for now, we made some progress and I'm always happy with that. I also did a skull with a cobra and some roses in it. That was on my dad. We got the line work done in the first session and then we were able to complete it with the color and stuff. And it was my first like bigger old school type tattoo. And I think it turned out great. He likes it, um, it was fun. I got to do a lovely 444 tattoo. I see a lot of those. She loves the Wendy's 444, so we decided to make it into a tattoo. Not actually. She wanted angel numbers. She went through a whole thing. She's trying to get better, and I think that's awesome. So the 444 is really symbolizing that for her, and she's moving forward in life away from previous struggles. So it was actually a really fun tattoo to do it. The girl was very sweet. I have uh, two designs currently up for grabs. I have a snake crawling through the bushes. Uh, he's crawling around some, some roses. It's a corn snake, I think, I'm pretty sure. And I have a tarot card. It's a lady holding a lion. She's this lady, she's got mauled by a lion. It's very, it's a cool tattoo, so. Get the tattoo. Another tattoo that I did this week that was fun was on a co-worker of mine. We like to tattoo each other in the shop a lot, so. Well, you know, doing this super easy tattoo. 
for the next 12 hours. A co-worker of mine had tattooed herself before she started here. She did a wonderful job on her leg, uh, creating these eyes. And so they were fairly dark, so we had to cover them up. So to pull the focal point, we went above the tattoo and did a mandala with octopus tentacles and tentacles coming out of a new set of eyes over top of the other one. Uh, the piece orients well, and I think it's a pretty good cover up on it overall. Hi, Pan and Eric. Lovely. Yeah? Yeah, I love this. Yeah. It's fantastic. Such a good day. <laughs> Good morning. We're waking up for our day. Got to film our first day of the intros. Shout out Longmont Public Media. See everybody later. Our team kind of came up with the concept of maybe we can use a car or a house or something that they're all like hanging out and partying in, but it's obviously CGI. <laughs> so we have my old broke down, super awesome, badass blazer sitting out back. And so we economically put everybody inside the blazer. Had a really good time with the group, man. We got into the blazer, kind of did a 70s show style intro. Everyone's rocking out, heavy metal, Metallica's playing. I'd have to say it was a little bit challenging. You um, know, we finally got everybody out there, and by the time we did that, I think we had like five people sitting there sweating, punching each other, <laughs> yelling at each other. We did it in the middle of the summer in a car that doesn't necessarily run, so it's just been sitting there in the sun, baking, waiting for us to get in. It was hot as hell. <laughs> yeah, the blazer, it's hot. That was hot. Oh, uh, what's was supposed to cuss, but it was hot, okay? <laughs> you know, fighting over the driver's wheel, who's gonna drive the car. Of course it's gonna be Sharky. I'm driving, it's my car. There you go. <laughs> We gotta shake the vehicle while being on top of it, acting like we were surfing. You have eight people, nine people, in a car that's not built for nine people, and we're all wearing black and it's hot out, and we're all sweaty. So it smelled bad. More people than there were seats. It was a lot of fun being that close to everyone. I don't think any of us ever want to be that close again. It was a nice kind of like little bonding moment. But no, it was a lot of fun, so cool. And it really fits all of our personalities and then our shop personality as a whole. Yeah! But it was actually kind of fun, I will admit. But. I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> we all kind of had a good time, so I don't know what the f else to say about that, Will. I think that's good. The video looks way more cooler than the actual experience. It was pretty cool, but. <laughs> yeah, shout out Will, 88 Visuals. If you don't know, now you know. Also, I want to send a special shout out to my man Rich. He's been killing it with his video edits. So if you guys like this stuff and you want to see us continue, please help us to grow this channel. Help us get likes on this channel, get shares and subscribers. There's plenty of opportunities and ways that you can do that. If people have comments or if they want to be able to make suggestions, please feel free to, to, to send us whatever messages you'd like, uh, no hate mail. Well, maybe a little hate mail, I don't really care. But anyway, regardless, please continue to support us. Thank you so much for the time that, that you guys have taken to be here. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks to all my clients. Thanks to everybody who supported us. Hope you all enjoyed the video. Looking forward to see plenty of new faces and old faces at the shop. I definitely look forward to meeting some of you as well as doing some more tattoos. Check out my Instagram and everybody else in the shop. We got some bookings and availables open right now uh, over the next month. Well, give us a call. Thank you. Just waiting for you to cut. <laughs>